Hi everybody, it's Philly from Create and Create here. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make your own DIY quilted jacket. So, as you heard right, we're going to be making a quilted jacket with absolutely no pattern whatsoever. We're just going to measure and wing it. I bought this guy, £3.50 in the charity shop. He's not that heavy actually, and there's not that much fabric to him. So, this is going to be a pattern for a more of a cropped jacket with a three quarter length sleeve. Here is what you need for the measurements. So this is the back and these are the front pieces so far. Um, I just wanted to quickly let you know that what I'm doing, aside from working around dog bowls, is trying to keep hold of all the bias around the edge. So when I'm cutting, I'm being really mindful that, so that's gonna be the bottom and then the bias will be going up the sides. And because quite luckily I have a lot left over, I can be really fussy with, so I'm gonna cut the sleeves and the sleeve cuff will be that side. And then I'll be able to work with the rough edges. I mean, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this side. I might have to make some bias binding to go just around the back of the neck, but otherwise use up what you've got and save yourself some energy. Okay, back, front, sleeve, sleeve to the machine. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is sew my front panels to the back using just the shoulder seams. I'm not gonna go down the side till the very end. So, step one, attach fronts at shoulder seams. So both the top bits are, or the front bits are on. I managed to find a little bit of bias binding. You should really bias all the raw edges, but I only had that much in my box. So that's all we're getting. Next, we're gonna go on to attaching the sleeves. So you want to find the midpoint of your sleeve, which is there. And then you want to line that up with your center seam, your seam here. 
Okay, so when you line those two up, let me turn it on that way. So when you line those two up, it will mean that your sleeve is front and centre. Ta -da! So we're going to sew along this bit here so that we then have the makings of all we need. Let's go. sides oh hang on that's better so we're just gonna sew down the sides and it's finished again like I said you could bias the inside seams but up to you but this whole thing has taken me half an hour maybe less including cutting <laughs> as well how easy <gasps> quick let's get it done It's a little bit sweaty actually because <laughs> it's quite a hot day so uh, note to self don't wear quilted stuff if it's a bit warm outside um, I just think it looks so nice made out of four rectangles of fabric and that's it and a little bit of clever sewing and I think it looks so cute I think maybe it could do with a wash just to like settle itself in or like a bit of wearing in do you know what I mean just because of everything being so stiff where it's been so used to laying nice and flat and now I've made it into something amazing. £3.50, a little bit of measuring and you have made yourself a quilted jacket. Ta-da! I'm really looking forward to wearing this on holiday. We're going on holiday next week. We are setting off to France. Hopefully I'll be able to take some videos whilst I'm there so that I can show you. Um, and I will be trying to wear as much of my me made outfits as possible. So please do keep up to date, subscribe, do the like thing, do all the buttons that you always have to do and then you'll be able to watch me on holiday as well. I will see you next week and have a great week. Bye.